Ruby Roo. Hey, Chino Bambino. It's just Bambi. Oh, that's where you got Bambi. Hi, huh, Fanny boy. Look at those ears. Flat back. Get me my food. That's not hey, how story. we work. You don't get your food until you put your ears up. Good morning, guys. Welcome to today's video. Today's video is all about dreams crushed. Gabby is dressed in all her riding clothes because today is the day that we're going to ride in the outdoor arena. She needs to do some cantering and some jumping, she said. Unfortunately, it's a, it's, there was no rain in the forecast. None. And then now suddenly, it's supposed to rain. Just a little tiny bit of rain, but yeah, we can't ride in the grass because it's raining. It's not, it's not horrible. It's not warm though. It, it's... <coughs> it what? She's dusty. Yeah, you got to be rolling. So it's not warm. It, we're at the time of the year where it's cool in the morning and then warmer in the afternoon. Really warm in the early evening it's okay and then if I it's ride cold after again. They have hay. Yeah. So like, let's just do chores, have breakfast, and then if it's still not bad, we'll come. I think we're gonna be able to do, to ride. I think we're just gonna because get a bit of spitting. Yeah, who lied? Webercasting lies because before he said it was going to sn have a snowstorm and it didn't. Right, and Sophie is like so excited for warm weather. <laughs> She's got her beer sleeves on. I'm wearing my apples in. Yeah, that'll keep you warm. Yeah. Lots of interesting comments on our video about road, road traffic. She's finally shedding. Yay! Wahoo! Uh oh, it's going all in her food, Sophie. <laughs> <laughs> Why don't you wait till she's done? Cause she'll run off probably. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> Clearly Air Channel reaches all around the world and there are different road rules for everyone. In Ontario where we live, um, we only go down this little tiny road. The road we go on has like maybe, we might see three cars in like a half an hour ride kind of thing. It's very quiet. It's, that's why we go on that one. We don't go on busy roads just because we're obviously so clearly inexperienced and our horses are still just coming out of winter. But um, the rules for us is that we uh, ride down the side of the road. We face the, the traffic. It would definitely be dangerous if we were going along with traffic. If we were like a, a, a cart, like, a, like the Amish, they pull carts, definitely they would ride um, in the same lane is traffic but because we are just riding we're like pedestrians we follow the same rules as pedestrians basically so we go facing traffic so that they can see us and we can see them and also um and cars are meant to always slow down and move to the side just like if we were on a bike or or walking they always are meant to avoid us and to use as much precaution as possible not to spook the horse because obviously horses are spooky and horse is a horse and no matter how trained they are um you have to be careful so that's so and the other thing that i didn't mention is that we are respectful to other people and we never ever just go out there and just take over the road yes you have seen us walking not us walking down the middle of the road but you've seen us crossing across the road because um, there's a big hill so we go one way before the hill and then after the hill for visibility reasons but my point is because the road we walk on is so low traffic um, the girls will ride down the middle of the road for a few minutes when we've made sure that there are no cars coming it's, we can see for miles and miles and miles so it's kind of like if you're riding with your kid and there's no cars anywhere and they ride on the road for a little bit but we're always respectful just know that we are always respectful Willow has a bite you got bit? It's just hair missing. Let's see. Right here. Is it a bite? He is. Gracie's like, what is it? I think that's from her blanket. Yeah, maybe. Uh oh. I would not eat from her bowl. She'd be mad at you. See? <laughs> Look at all the hair. Yeah, we need to bring her in today and do that. You wanna? Sophie would love to set up like an obstacle course somewhere. That's why when Gabby's so, riding her horses, I'm going to be playing with Finn, doing obstacles, riding him over jumps. Yeah, so we did plan for Sophie to ride Finn today. Like I said, I would give him Equizen 
or we would do like a bunch of things to prepare her, walk him around a bunch of times, let her see how he's feeling around outside uh, before she rode him. Um, so in the end, because it's kind of yucky weather and it's windy and yucky, um, we decided that she's just gonna walk him around, play with him in the arena today, and then the next time that we ride out there, which may be, be tomorrow, um, she's going to ride him, right? We just wanna like go slow. Yeah, she does need another walk. Oh, Sophie, everybody said I was walking on the right side of the horse yesterday. What? I said that too. Yeah, good job. Hey, Gino Bambino, AKA Bambi. I get why you're calling him Bambi now. We've seen every horse lay down this week except for Finn. Do we have more shavings? Yeah, we have more shavings. I'll go out tomorrow and get shavings. It's Easter. What are you hoping to get for Easter, Gabby? I don't know. Are you past Easter? Chocolate. Chocolate, yeah, Gabby is all about the chocolate. What are you hoping to get for Easter? Um, let me think. Molly back. You want Gabby's puppy to come? No, my chicken back. Oh, all right. You know what I all right. out? What? Um, Molly Weasley. In Harry Potter. Molly Weasley? Oh yeah. Mom. Yeah. I'm sure Gabby copied the, my name. We all love the name Molly. We just love the name Molly. Molly's like the best mom though. She's like, Bruh, where have you went? No, 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 on your bed? You, no car in the driveway? Oh, hi Harry. Run! <laughs> yeah, she is the best mom. Uh, what are you hoping to get for Easter, Sophie? So, a chicken back because she is so sweet. Okay. Oh, I'm sorry, Gabby. She literally walks up to you. Um, chocolate, more chocolate, a bunny, more chocolate. Oh! A bunny, I want a chocolate bunny. And I forgot a mini. No, Willow in the house when I wake up. Yeah, that's not going to happen. Ruby, what do you want for Easter? I want a new... Do you want a, a puppy to play with? A puppy to drive you crazy or a haircut? A uh, puppy. We oh, might resort to cutting to her hair. Macy all the time and Macy's like, you're too big. I know. She wants to play with Macy and Macy's old and Macy's like, get off of me! And um, she tries to play with the cat. You know, she only tries to play with her when um, she goes outside. Do you know what the cat has been doing lately? It's the most the horrific cat. thing. Our cat. No. Sleeping with me. I wake up in the night yeah, and she's right by. No, I made the bed and she never moved. Like, she... no, she used to sleep with me. Did she? We'll take her back. I don't want her. Why do all Gabby's pets sleep with mom? And she used to wake me up in the middle of the night because she used to lay on the bed. Yeah. Her. So yes. Right by my ear. She sleeps right by my ear. It's been a struggle getting the hay out to the field. So we have one. We have a muck bucket for poop clean up and then we have one for hay that I used to have soaked Stella's hay in so um, I just so we're gonna try this taking it out on this little cart each day instead of trying to carry it because nobody likes a brothel of hay it's the worst remember when you, you don't ever get a brothel of hay oh lucky you I do uh, you remember when you slept on here on our video 24 hours in the barn wasn't that fun? If you haven't seen that video, 24 Hours in the Barn, you should watch it. I watched it again the other day. It's so funny. I've been loving asking you guys questions. You've always come through answering them for me. I appreciate all your responses. I read them all. Um, how do you guys handle cleaning the scoop boots? Do you take a hose to them after you ride in them each day? Do you brush them with a hard brush? Like, this is kind of nuts. 
How in the heck do you guys clean these things? All right, it is 10 a.m. Uh, we just finished chores. The girls beat me up here. I just finished sweeping. But it has been one week exactly since the horses have been home. And Storm has one scratch on his face. I swear Chino kicked him. I saw him boot him with his front paw, with his front hoof. And I'm like, ooh, he just... He just smacked him in the face and Gabby thought that he missed, but he did have like a big cut down here. Just, just barely the top layer of skin off, like no blood or anything. And yeah, and Chino had one bite on his neck. That's it, that's all we had. Like Storm is still the leader. Chino is kinda in the middle and and Finney is at the bottom. Um, but yeah, it's like, it's incredible. It's been incredible. Like thank you God for this. But I have another question for you guys. Sophie over here with he her hand up. He stands up for himself. Yeah, he does a little. What's Chino? So, two questions in this vlog. Now that I have no Fiona, I mean, I could message her, but now that I have no Fiona and no Brandon, I've been asking you guys all my questions. Um, so, you know how I said, like, we our horses were kind of nutso last summer. Did you think they were nutso? Yeah, they were nutso a little, like... I don't know, just not as chill as they are now. Like, they are so chill right now, and I can't figure out what it is. But yesterday I was thinking, like, do you guys think it's the grass? Like, grass is good for horses, as long as they don't have any underlying issues. But do you think it's, like, all the grass? Like, do you think because they're eating so much more sugar and so much more fresh? I don't know. Do you think it's the grass in the summer? Like, should I be anticipating another crazy summer? Or do you think this is it? Like, our horses are so good. It's no use working nine to five. If you want more than to stay alive, come on over, no we can make it through. Take my hand, I'll know just what to do. I'm a big key dancing through the night. Stay up until the morning light, the morning light falls. Oh. and it is pouring rain. Pouring right now, so we are not riding. We're not riding our horses, but we're gonna get to play with them and groom them. The horses were freaking out. They finished their lunch, and when it's raining, I swear, Storm gets so mad. He was chasing them all around. They were bucking, kicking. They haven't done that in days and days. They haven't done it since the last time it rained. So here are all the things that I wanna get this year. I wanna get buzzers, like, um, what are they called, Gabby? Clippers. Clippers. I want to get clippers and shave our horses down. Not all of our horses, but I want to shave her down for sure. She needs it. This is not coming off. Like the neck is not coming off. Yeah, I know. It's, that's always the last part to come for her. I want to shave them down. I want to get a cart for um, Willow. Willow so that we can teach her to drive and we'll get somebody to help us. We won't just do okay. it by herself. When she's all trained. Um, I'm going to bring Willow down the road power her up and go get her ice cream. Yeah, that will be in 27 years, but I... For my um, unhealthy snack. For your unhealthy snack. And I also want to get, what do I want to get for you? Look at, if you put it, just if I stood in the right angle, it looked like Willow, or Gracie was wearing a red Santa hat. So what I want to get is another mini, but a baby. I kind of want that too. So um, I they can be like my dog and stay in the house with us, not have to be an outside pony. Unfortunately, all horses have to be outside ponies. But there's these people in their Instagrams. They have like their miniature babies are in their house sleeping. Yeah, or sleeping with a dog. It's only when they're little, and I've seen stuff like that too. But it's when they're little, when my baby's little, I can bring. And then. Um, so yeah, that's not safe. What the heck are you thinking? How? Oh my goodness. Gracie. Okay, so a lot of people were saying, commenting on the fact that Ruby was wearing a, a halter the other day. Halters can be made into 
What are they called? Harnesses. Into harnesses for dogs. Gabby showed me how. Fiona showed her. This one's too big because it's a, it's a horse one. How did you do it? Take the nose part. Take the nose part. And put their head through it. And then you can see the two, that part in the middle. You put each leg through. And then you do it up. And then you just do it up around her waist. Ta-da! A harness for a dog if you ever are in a pinch someplace and you need one. Ruby! on this bed and the, the horses want to nibble her. Um, I'm gonna one to one. Okay. After all the things I know now, I would definitely get, I would, I would definitely get another mini, like, I don't regret, I do not regret getting her one single second, do you? What? I don't regret getting her, do you? No. She's the best pony I've ever had. Yeah. Other than Finn. Other than who? Finn. Other than Finn. I think that's the cutest color on her, Sophie. Guys, comment down below if I should get Willow more altar. All together. terrified of Willow. Every time she lays up here, the horses want to sniff her, and it, she's terrified of them. She's like, help me, help me. Today didn't work out for us because we really wanted to ride outside in the arena. 
Hopefully we'll be able to do it tomorrow. Um, at least we were able to find something fun to do. And I am super grateful for this little arena. Sometimes I complain about it, but I am so grateful that we can just sit here on this little bench and play with our ponies and just have fun as a family. Like, especially during these times, I feel for all of you guys out there missing horses. Like, a lot of you guys have made horses your entire lives and now not to be able to see them is, I, I know if we couldn't have brought our horses home. <laughs> She's smelling. She's licking the blanket. She, she's smelling Ruby's smell. 